Hello everyone, Rexland here. In this short video, we'll briefly talk about a newly implemented system from the Kowloon Metropolis patch, Resonance Overclocking. Resonance Overclocking, or OC for short, is basically the act of using a set of new materials to boost the stats of a memory in its corresponding placement. For example, performing OC on slots 4, 5, 6 would increase your attack and defense stats, whereas 1, 2, and 3 would boost the HP and crit stats. Bear in mind that this system is only available for memories that have been max leveled to 45. And this is where optimal memory position really matters when you're planning on OC since you'll want to get the most stats out of it. As the greater the stat boost, the more BP you'll get, and for the spending players, this is how 8000 BP is possible for certain characters at SSS Plus with fully resonated memories and weapons. Take note that the OC boost only applies to the resonated character, much like your resonated skills. Rerolling your resonated skill does not affect the OC, so don't worry about it. When the OC is complete, the resonance arrow color changes from blue to cyan, and the increased stats will be reflected on your character's BP. As for the materials, at this time of posting, be sure to do Phalanx which is available during Kowloon Metropolis. Join Warfare, or Unitus for short, is a new permanent co-op mode and it can get really difficult so I personally recommend just setting the co-op fight on the easiest mode because the difference in drops is negligible. Be sure to check the weekly missions and claim them when you're done with Unitus. Once you have sufficient OC crystals, you can purchase the corresponding OC materials that you need in the shop. As the material is extremely scarce, do be extra careful and not make any mistakes in purchasing them. I personally recommend overclocking your main attacker constructs first. Elemental characters do not really need OC for slots 1, 2, and 3 since crit stat doesn't do much for them. In the near future, OC materials will also be for sale in the guild shop. To sum it all up, here are some notes to take away from this video. We've come to the end of this short tutorial and I hope it has been helpful to you in understanding the Resonance OC system. Consider leaving a like, comment and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video.